So, the big update about the project I've been working on. Um, as you all know, I've been showing you little snippets here and there. Today I'm going to show you um, three full instrumentals. Um, so, let's see. So, I want to show you, first off, um, so basically... It's a worship album, but it's also a devotional album. It's going to have some scripture in between, some interludes. Um, all original songs, except for the instrumentals. Um, those will be familiar songs that you know. And uh, it's just going to get you to that secret place uh, where you can just have that one-on-one -on -one with, with Jesus. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the revamped some revamp stuff and the first one is the album cover and this is what I have um, another thing to let you guys know is originally the album was called Divine Worship for the Almighty that has now been scrapped and it is now called No Other Place um, which is one of the tracks on the album and is now the title track and this is what it looks like very simple and I'm also going to show you the set list um, of songs some of them you may have heard me play on the piano um, and maybe some you haven't I have some old ones that I've uh, that I wrote a while back and some recently new ones like Keeper of My Heart um, so here we go I'm going to show you the set list starts out with God You Are Victorious King those two songs are a little upbeat to start the album. And then we have an uh, interlude of, uh, and with some scripture in which I'm going to show you a whole one at the end here. I'm going to show you a, a whole interlude. About a little over a minute. Um, a little special video I made with it. Um, and then we... Uh, smooth things a lot with uh, Just As I Am I Come and To Keeper of My Heart really getting you know to that that secret place of worship no other place and then we have another interlude with scripture and then we go into Only Yours Power in Your Name interlude with scripture um, to uh, probably a, a, probably a upbeat scripture and just a, a more of a um, excitement scripture which leads to the last song which is an upbeat at the end song of praise so with that being said mm, want to listen to some stuff all right um, we're gonna start out with the first song and it, these are just the instrumentals I don't have vocals recorded yet on them um, so here we go, music. I got so much stuff. Here we go. This is, uh, this first song on, and it's the first track on the, the record is called God You Are and it's actually I wrote that back in 2015 and I was just starting to go to Life Coast and I just came out of a really good service and suddenly God gave me this whole song in like a half hour and you may have heard me play it on some lives I don't play it as much as I um, used to but it's still a really good song and it's just a perfect uh, beginning to a very um, special uh, song list. 
So here we go. Glad you are. Next one, um, this is the one that really starts the worship trend on the album. Um, this is called Just As I Am I Come, and it's basically, I wrote it off of a hymn, and uh, here we go, Just As I Am I Come. Just uh, close your eyes, relax, just feel the presence of God. Here we go.
hope you enjoyed that one as well. And I got one more. One more. You want one more? You want to hear another one? Alright. This next one, um, I wrote back in, uh, 2010, if I remember correctly. So I, I actually have a little history of this. Um, I performed this at my friend's church at the time, back in Palm Coast. Um, I literally was just, I was at a, a youth function, and uh, I just started playing the songs. I wanted to show my friend Mike Adoom. Um, I hope I hope you see this. Um, I wanted to show my friend Mike the new song I wrote called "Only Yours," and his pastor heard it. He's like, "You got to perform that in my congregation." And uh, it was actually the first song I've ever performed in front of everybody. That was one of my songs um, and I was so honored and I still have that video it's actually on YouTube um, so without further ado let's uh, show you um, only yours
right. So yes, that was only yours. Now, this whole album is going to be two parts. There's going to be the first part, which is going to be the full album with the vocals and the scripture reading in between the interludes. The second part, just that. Instrumental. Just helped you get to that secret place as well. Um, I don't have an exact date of release, but I'm looking at fall. I'm looking at October. That's what I'm zoning for. Um, I got two more songs to record for the for the project and two interludes. Two songs, two interludes, and then of course I gotta re-record vocals on or whatever they done. Uh, Victorious King, it's one of them, and uh, the title track, No Other Place. And uh, let's see, before I go, yep, there's that one last thing I gotta show you. You ready for it? So, what I meant to also say too is during the interludes, it's not my original music. Um, I do instrumental covers. So, you'll recognize those. Probably right off the bat, like this one. In the year that King Uzziah died, I saw the Lord sitting upon a throne, high and lifted up, and the train of his robe filled the temple. Above him stood the seraphim, each had six wings. With two he covered his face, and with two he covered his feet, and with two he flew. And one called to another and said, Holy, holy, holy is the Lord of hosts. The whole earth is full of his glory. And the foundations of the thresholds shook at the voice of him who called and the house was filled with smoke. And I said, Woe is me, for I am lost, for I am a man of unclean lips, and I dwell in the midst of people of unclean lips. For my eyes have seen the King, the Lord of hosts. And that leads to just as I am I come. So basically coming off of two praise songs and then you hear that and then it goes in to worship. That's it. <clears throat> um, yes, I have an instrumental to keep her in my heart. No, I am not going to show you that one. And the reason why I'm not going to show you that one is because I have other plans for that particular uh, song next month. We're coming up to a year anniversary and uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna re-release it with the remastered version, acoustic, um, the cut version and the instrumental version. So definitely got that to look forward to and hopefully I can try to get a live version for it. Not sure if I'm going to be able to do it. Kind of time is running out. Um, so yeah, that is the big update. The album is on the way. October is what I'm gunning for right now. Once I have an official release date, I will let you all know. Um, I'm so excited. I really think I just my my hope for this is to really help people 
and go into that secret place of worship. Just that one-on-one -on -one with God. And, uh, just, you know, brings in the Holy Spirit and just get lost in the flow. Well, that is it for tonight. Um, thank you guys so much for coming on in. And for those who have yet to watch the video, I'm going to um, edit this video and then repost it uh, later on. So, thank you again, Brianna, Michael, and Christian. And for those who came in earlier on the other video that had the super, super horrible quality... I hope you get to see this one with a much better quality and that way you can hear uh, a much better on the instrumentals. So I hope you enjoyed all it. Just remember that um, no matter what you're going through, he, he's there. He loves you. Jesus our Lord, our God, he is holy and just. God bless you guys.